we'll review the latest CDs. And Gina Gallia is going to show us some alternatives to shopping at the mall. All that and a lot more when we come back with Teen Talk. We're back with Teen Talk. There's still a few good months left of the ski season, and you know what, Tracy? I haven't gone yet. You know what? I haven't either, but that's okay because Todd, Steve, and Jimmy have. Of course. The three amigos get to go everywhere, from go-kart racing to their blue hair do at the Velocity Room. Yeah, they're such a bunch of pains. I want my hair to be blue. But now they're at Mountain High taking their first ski lesson, and you've got to see this. This is their funniest one yet. Hello, Team Top viewers. This is a critical situation. We don't know where we are. We could be in St. Louis for all we know. Hey, look, snow. No one here has red pants, dude. Well, we just arrived at Mountain High, and um, we're about ready to meet our instructor. I'm, I'm looking forward to falling. I'm looking forward to falling a lot of bruises, but hopefully I can learn how to ski because We've never skied before. <laughs> Stevie? I'm looking forward to good fun. <laughs> Let's get started. Hello, we're here right now with Bill. He is our instructor for, for the day. And Bill, how long have you been instructing? I've been here approximately six years. Do you find that when people start skiing, is it easy for them at first, or is their first time kind of hard and it gets better the more times they ski? A lot of times it depends on the psychological profile or the makeup of the individual. If they're athletic and they're able to um, adapt to any given situation and listen to what the instruction are, they shouldn't have a problem skiing. Phil, where are you from? Uh, Encino. Encino? Phil, how do you like conditions up here at Mountain High? They're good. Do you like do you like the skiing conditions around here? Um, how about the lift? So the lift's too high for you, or is it scary getting up there or what? I've only gone on two, so I'm not really sure. <laughs> are you a, are, are you? I mean, it's not that I've only gone on two, it's just, it's just I didn't want to go on the other ones, okay? <laughs> okay, let's not get violent here. It's kind of cold out. How are your hands holding up? <laughs> it's just, you know, it's cold stuff. How long have you been snowboarding for? About three seasons now. Uh, how does snowboarding differ from regular skiing? Well, it makes skiing obsolete basically because you can't do all the tricks that you can do snowboarding. The maneuvers, to me, is just like a natural progression from skateboarding and surfing. And, you know, it's just like surfing really a 3,000 foot wave when you're going down on it. How long have you been snowboarding? This is only my third time. Were you a skier before that? No. What got you into snowboarding? Skating. Uh, My worst thing has been the chairlift. I've, I've fallen off there a few times. You know, I've fallen off, I've fallen off twice. <laughs> Alright, now I uh, just graduated from the bunny slope and now I'm in the intermediate. So I'm getting ready right now. Are you having fun, Steve? It's fun. That concludes a fun-filled day of skiing, bruising, wedging, and all a bunch of other stuff. Jimmy, what'd you get out of today's skiing? Well, I learned to turn a lot, you know. For the first day, I think I did pretty good. And, um... I recommend it for other people. Steve? Steve? I had lots of fun even though I fell down a lot and it's kind of cold and my pants were getting wet but besides that it was fun. Yeah, um, I have a lot more respect for regular skiers now. Don't you? Okay, well I guess that's about it. Back to you Bobic. back to you Tracy.
very best You're the very best in all you do You're the very best We put you to the test And we're the very best because of you You're the heart and soul behind our progress We never could have made it without you Tackle every challenge and you go that extra mile. Hey, look, snow. Todd, Jimmy, you guys didn't do too bad for your first time. But Steve, buddy, well, what can I say? Better luck next season. There are some people who like to...